baseboard management controllers or BMCs represent a underemphasized but huge attack surface for data centers, including AI data centers. So I'm going to do a quick walkthrough of how to investigate the security of your baseboard management controllers or BMCs inside of Eclipsium. I'm starting here at the Eclipsium management console and I'm going to go to our asset list and then I'm going to filter down to only assets with GPUs in them. And then I'm going to look at one of these and just click in and go check out the baseboard management. So I see my baseboard management here is from Supermicro Computer. It's version 1.3. It's noted as trusted in our interface right now. And I'm just going to see what sort of details I can get about it. So it looks like this passed its last integrity scan. What that means is that the firmware hasn't changed from the last time that we scanned it to this time, which is good because changing the firmware of a baseboard management controller could lead in the event of a cyber attack could provide the cyber attacker with a great degree of control and influence over the entire environment because the baseboard management controller has a lot of uh, impact on any sort of device that it's part of the management plane for. If I scroll down, I can see a lot more details about this particular baseboard management controller. Uh, I can see the manufacturer ID, the name of the manufacturer, the fact that it has passed all of its self tests of which there were 85 and various other sort of details about it. Uh, you can see also the hash for this exact or the ID for this exact scan that happened and you can download the results of that scan. And then down here we can see a little bit of pros about what the BMC attack surface represents. Uh, so BMCs provide out of band management for modern servers. It's completely independent of the host operating system. A BMC will typically have a full Linux distro on it. So it's like a whole computer within your computer and numerous vulnerabilities have been disclosed in BMCs, including this year in AMI BMCs discovered by the Eclipsium research team. But going back years and years and years, baseboard management controllers are well known for having vulnerabilities in them. And NVIDIA started looking into the potential risk that BMCs represent to AI data centers, and they discovered 18 vulnerabilities and came up with, I think, nine proof of concept exploits against BMCs that could represent a risk to an AI data center today. So this is a very real, very current active attack surface that could represent a huge risk to the infrastructure of an AI data center. And if we go back into the Eclipse interface, we can see that there are various attack types that Eclipsium is able to detect against BMCs various known vulnerabilities against BMCs going back as far as 2013 uh, and as recent as uh, 2021. And I think we've probably got some even more recent ones that aren't just integrated into our actual demo environment yet. So this is how you can get details into the firmware of your baseboard management controllers across your entire fleet of AI infrastructure and hardware inside of your AI data center to make sure that you're not vulnerable to stuff like, well, your BMCs having a known default password still active uh, would be a big one, but also to make sure that they're not vulnerable to things like the Cloudborn attack, which was something from 2019 that allowed attackers to take control of an entire fleet of devices by overwriting the device firmware on a baseboard management controller. So if you're operating a data center, if you're building a new data center or involved in AI data center infrastructure at all, part of your device lifecycle management should absolutely be to scan and monitor your BMCs and continuously reassure the integrity of the firmware in those BMCs and make sure that there have not been backdoors or malware misconfigurations introduced into your BMCs, either when they're initially brought into the environment or between customers. If you're renting out bare metal capacity to your customers and then reclaiming it, that was the situation in the 2019 Cloudborn attack, was that between customers, the BMC firmware wasn't being reflashed or monitored, and the vulnerability was introduced into the BMC by one customer and then propagated across other customers. So monitoring and managing the security of your baseboard management controllers is 
a critical part of maintaining good security posture for an AI data center, and Eclipsium can help you do that at scale across your entire environment. Thank you.